Hello friends, I'm so glad you could join me today. I am documenting my journey on becoming debt-free again, so welcome to Second Chance Budgeting. I'll be exploring cash stuffing and unstuffing, finding ways to increase my income, and saving towards some big goals, all while digging myself out of debt once again. I hope you'll consider subscribing to my channel. I would love to have you join me during my adventures. Today I want to do a quick debt update for March 2024 and show you the progress that I've made during this month. Um, so let's just get into it. I started off March um, with a total debt of $14,218.01. And let me show you what I did. So um, definitely this has already been paid in full, so don't need to worry about that anymore. Um, in March, I paid $50 on my anesthesia bill. So that dropped my amount down to $489.40. All right, and I'm gonna color in one section. So I'm pretty happy with the progress that I'm making there. Um, all right, for my ER doctor, I paid $40 on this bill, and that dropped me down to $865. Um, I'm going to do a little section like this. Okay. Um, all right, here's, here's my frustrating debt at the moment. Um, so in February, I had called to make a payment because their um, online payment system was not working. So I called in February to ask if I could pay my bill, and they said that it had not been finalized yet. And um, so I called in March again, <laughs> and I got the same answer. Um, so frustrating, definitely frustrating. Um, so I did what I um, had done in February again, the amount that I would have paid. So my minimum of $50 that I would have paid, um, I went ahead and put into a savings account. So when, whenever this bill finally gets completed or whatever needs to happen on their end, um, I will go ahead and pay that amount. Um, I'm a little, concerned because I still have not seen a bill for this other than just what I was able to look up in this portal um, that I was making my payments through. Um, and this is the amount that I got from, from there. So I don't even know if this is like the amount that I need to pay in full or I don't know what's happening. So I, I'm trying to get more information, but they're just not telling it to me. And unfortunately it's the exact same person that I'm calling. Um, they said that I could send in a check, but I'm I'm just leery of doing that until um, I see a bill and it's finalized and I see it in paper. I just, I really wanna pay this bill because I loved my surgeon. He did such amazing things for me and this would be my top priority, honestly, if, if there was a bill to pay. Um, so I'm just hoping that it gets finalized very soon. Um, so for right now, I haven't been able to do anything with this, but again, I saved the $50 in a savings account. And once I can pay this, I will just pay the, the, the months prior. I don't know what else to do. <laughs> All right. And then, um, for my hospital bill, um, I didn't have a lot this month to put towards that, but I did pay $10. Um, so that brought me down to $3,725.12. 10 bucks is still bringing this down, so I'm okay with that. <laughs> All right, and then in March for my vehicle loan, I went ahead and did my normal car payment. Um, so that brought my balance down to 6000 $508.56. And I also um, completed a savings challenge. 
um, of $100 towards debt. And I decided since I was having difficulties with my surgeon, um, which is where I wanted to put the money for, for that savings challenge, I decided to go ahead and put it towards my vehicle loan um, because my vehicle loan at the moment is the only one accruing interest. So um, that was kind of my reasoning behind it. Um, so with that $100 extra payment, that brought me down to $6,408.56. And obviously, like, I made it the same day, so um, no interest um, had accrued on that day or whatever. There's, there's interest between these two, but um, that $100 just went purely to principal, and so I was pretty happy with that. Um, so I am going to a little bit it didn't it's not it's not a full amount but um, it still made a little bit of a dent so um, overall um, I'm able to color in one one more line on this for all of my March progress and so total that brought me down to 13,000 $876.92. So I think that that's pretty great. Um, so I'm now in the 13,000s. So very exciting for me. <laughs> um, in total in March, um, I paid off a total of $341.09 worth of debt that is no longer will not come back. <laughs> so that's everything for March. I hope you enjoyed this one. Um, so please do all the things like or leave me a comment or question and subscribe for more. I'll see you in the next one. Have a great day.